Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Shashi and I'm a runner. Today I'm going to talk about running form. A good running form helps you run faster, more efficiently and it also helps you avoid running injuries. There are three important things about a good running form. Posture, foot strike and cadence. I'll talk about these three points one by one. The first important thing about a good running form is posture. When you run, your posture should be straight, erect. Don't slouch. Some people when they run, they lower their hips as if they are sitting on a saddle on a horse. Don't do that. Stand straight and always run tall. Look to the front. You should be looking at the ground 10 to 20 feet ahead of you. Your chin should be slightly up. Open up your chest. When you open up your chest, your diaphragm also opens up. And this helps you breathe better. Imagine that you are a puppet and somebody is pulling you with a string attached to your head. Like this. So this will keep you absolutely straight. Don't jut your head forward like this. When you jut your head forward, you are putting a lot of stress on your neck and shoulders. So don't do that. Your head should be in the middle of your shoulders. Now, to improve your posture, you should do plank exercise. If you do two minutes plank every day, it will improve your posture and consequently your running form will also improve. The second important thing about a good running form is foot strike. How your foot is striking the ground while you are running. Never strike the ground on the heel. This is wrong. Always strike the ground at the midfoot like this. This is correct. When you strike the ground at midfoot, your foot is in contact with the ground for the least time. And this helps you run faster. Now the second thing is, Always strike the ground right under your knee, like this. This is correct. This is correct. And your shin should not be ahead of uh, your knee. This is wrong. If you do this, this is called overstriding. Overstriding is bad for you because it causes running injuries. Now, when your foot goes backward, see, when your this foot uh, foot is going back should rise to a level where the shin is parallel to the ground like this the shin should be parallel to the ground so you have to uh, when the foot is going backward you have to raise it to a level where it is parallel to the ground now i'm showing you the, the entire circular motion yeah you understand it goes like a v this was all about foot striking the third important thing about a good running form is cadence. Cadence is number of times your foot strikes the ground. An ideal cadence is 180 steps per minute. If your cadence is in the range of 165 to 180, you are good. But try to bring it close to 180. With some practice, you can achieve this. Count the number of times your foot is hitting the ground in one minute. And try to bring it close to 180. 